God, I can't stand the freaking. It's so. And it, it, like the ambiance for shit really gets me, but like the weird whoa, 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 type of noise, like just specifically really bothers me because it's like shit that you don't actually hear in real life. June 16th. June 16th of when? Just June 16th? This happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. I still remember this very clearly because of how creeped out I felt. I was a bit hesitant to write this out for the internet at first. Uh, but getting it out may help, even if just a little bit. Well, I was one of those people that loves gaming conventions. I'd go to every convention I'd get the chance to, and sometimes even meet some of my online friends. Though my parents weren't always thrilled at the idea of me going on, inter on interstate drives, but a plane ticket would have been too expensive. I mean, hey, if they are offering for the plane ticket, then sure. Like, like maybe you pay half of the ticket and they pay the other half of the ticket. But, like, yeah, I get it. Plane tickets are expensive. Especially, like, now. They're just, they're fucking skyrocketing. <clears throat> this convention I was at went great. And it was now the day to drive back home. When I, but when I set off, I soon realized the traffic was horrible. I decided that I'd take the long way to avoid the traffic. It was a little over tw a 12 hour drive. Um. Fuck that. I would have taken the fucking traffic way. Oh, we gotta drive? Oh, I thought that said to get God. I'm like, what? We can call God up in here? <laughs> we can honk. Oh god, I like... I cannot read this one. Um... Sorry, let me just pull over to the side so I can, I can read. Let me read. Um, you called? Yeah, I think I'm going to that convention. Uh, could I get your car for like five days? With who? Aiden. That internet friend? He's a nice guy. No, you're not going on a 10 hour drive by yourself. Well, I've already made up my mind. I'll drive you. Why don't you understand anything? Let's talk when I get home. Drive safe, Holly. Don't forget to call me. You got it, Dad. Anything else? Leaving now. Drive safe, Holly. Um. Discord. We got ticks. So, I'll see if I can get the car. Let you know. Finally going to take Milo on a walk. LOL. Alright, lol. Okay, the plan is on. Hell yes. Wait, you're getting the car? Yup. I thought that said baby girl. I'm like, what? Don't think you, you you would have said that to dad. You mentioned that to dad. You sure Ash can't come? I'll get the skateboard too. Saw this really cool skate park nearby. Sounds fun. Discord, where are you? Almost there. I don't see why. Peach shirt? It was fun. I had a good time. Thanks for joining me. Again, you sure driving all the way back? I mean, I can't take the plane and leave dad's car. I only really have a choice now, do I? Could have left tomorrow morning. Okay, give me a call when you reach back to your cave. Okay, dad. Not sure if it'll be lifetime though. What do you mean? Stuck in the biggest traffic jam of the country. That sucks. That's not too good here either. I think it's people from the convention. I got the reader. <laughs> That's it. I'm rerouting here. You gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, what's the thing? I would still choose the fastest route. Not the longest, because this shit, fuck that. When I drove to Arkansas to visit Suffren and meet him in person for the first time, I didn't drive through this kind of shit. I mean, it was going through the mountains, so it was just like, not too many trees, but like, I stayed on main, main roads and highways and shit. Like, 
Not highways like this. Sorry, let me just... Pull over to the side of the road real quick so I can... Where did you reach? Still about six hours away from the city. Got stuck in a jam. Should mention that you're taking a fucking highway through the middle of the woods. Can I accelerate? Let me go faster. See, I am I'm a good driver. I fuck. You don't have a gas can with you? You're halfway through the drive. I realized I was low on gas. I'm I am a good driver. I say I'm a good driver as I start driving in the middle of the damn road. <clears throat> See? Uh, I only needed to stop to get gas like twice on my way to uh oh shit. There's a, there's, there's a, whoops, told you to take that flight. Were you going to pay for it? Dad. I wasn't even, I'm rerouting through a town or through a road with excuse me. Exactly. Oh God. Get on the road. Sorry, Dad, I can't, I'm going to have to. Well, it's gonna be late when you get reach back. Hope you're all right. I, I'm, I'm okay. Oh god, I thought I saw a face in the mirror. That's just my mirror. Oh, Having a night. It really, really, really beautiful for me. It's okay. I. Um, I'm going to get the closest one over here. Hold on. That's, that's the lights. Why am I not turning the car off? What the fuck? Why can't I turn this car off? Okay, it's just dumb. It's pump two. I'm curious about this truck over here. I can't. I can run. That is my run. I mean, in real life, I would never just run over to some random truck. <laughs> it's a sketchy-ass gas station, right? Can I get $10 and pump to you? <clears throat> you headed to the bridge? Headed to the bridge by yourself? The bridge? Or Valley Bridge. I mean, not a lot of people head down there this time of year. Be careful. What do you mean? For about a century now, many people have been going missing down there, and people who went looking for them never return. Uh, locals say the Norwood Valley monster had torn them up and hung them upside down. Um, can I use it? It's not cleaned. Um. What? And one more thing. If you see a woman in white or blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. Just, just step on the gas as hard as you can. Some people say that she had died in a car accident. Prom night, some say that she seeks vengeance after she was murdered there. Regardless, she's out for blood. Whatever you do, never, ever, under any circumstances, pick up a shooting shatter. There's people out there on the road putting their thumbs out. They ain't what you think, ma'am. They just ain't. It's just a random truck. Hi! I would not walk up to some random person and just start talking to them. Um, how's your night going? You just looked at me. Where are you headed to? You just looked at me. Heard about the monster? Huh? The monster. Big mistake. Oh, I'm sorry. What are they doing out there? <clears throat> Holly? Mom? 
Yes. I'm just gonna... Woo! Stop for every... No, fuck that. I'm not gonna stop. I'll be... Excuse me! Excuse me! Excuse me! What were you doing with my car? I don't know if you'll find any shop at the sour, but we're out of dog food. Can you get some for Milo? I'll pay you back. Bro. How are you gonna f come fuck with my car while I'm here? Right? What the hell? What is this? I can't crouch in this, unlike the other one. So... Dog food. Um, anything else that I want? S sweet cookies. Popcorn. Dunkin' Donut shit. The wood. The creepy ass wood on the rock. Anything in here? Why are the baskets back here? Wow, sorry. Oh! Exit. Ooh! A chocolate bar? A soda? A, a heat snack? Nuts chocolate? I want some nuts chocolate. Give me that nuts chocolate! <laughs> up on nut chocolate. I think yo-yo. Oh, hi. Um, are these Coca-Cola or are these beers? Something tells me this is alcohol. I don't want alcohol. You got any, um, Jumex or Snapple or, um, that looks like it's Snapple. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna grab that. I want the. That's all. Okay. I mean, it. I. Okay. I filled the tank and I was off the, to the road again. Um. What about the dog food? I need to buy the dog food. Can I, just, can I just take it? I mean, I know I had another bag somewhere back here. I'm just gonna grab that. Don't let me. I mean, that's what I'm just gonna do. Bro, I tried paying for it. Give it to me. Okay. Okay, there we go. Five dollars for a bag of dog food. That's not bad for this size. Um, <clears throat> how much dog food can I buy? Was this sign always here? Expressos. Wait a minute. You don't have an espresso machine. Hmm. There we go. I was. Oh, wait. Guy. guy th dude. What? That was not always there. I mean, unless they did have an espresso machine. I don't want it. I was too low in cash for that. <laughs> but not for this. What else is here? You bubbles. Carrot drink, orange drink, milk chocolate, chocolate candies, grapefruit, chocolate, cola bottle, chocolate, 
nachos, chocolate bar, meat, potato chips. Oh, I got onion rings? Bro. Give me them funions. <coughs> I find it funny that I can reach it all the way from over here. Um, I also want this bag of dog food. I don't think I need more than one. I, or I can not. Fuck, I was hoping I could just throw it over there. I want to buy all of it, though. Um, maybe? I don't need that. Fine, I guess I don't. What are you playing? Oh, you're playing solitaire? By the way. Let me, let me just fuck everything up for you. I can't even pick up anything from over here. Your cigs. You don't want me to pick it up your cigs? Wait. What was... I legit just saw something that I could pick up. Just... <laughs> <laughs> Please! <laughs> I'm gonna get in trouble. For just grabbing random shit and throwing it. Hey, look at that. I want all these things. I'm sorry. <laughs> He's gonna fucking kill me later. He's gonna be the one that I need to watch out for. Is that a chair? That Was that chair always there? Can I sit in it? No, I can't. Um... to say like ew see look I don't use purses I use backpacks make sure to check my rear view mirrors make sure that nobody's coming and then get on the road being on the road you do realize the thing the chair was it the whole time monsters truly do exist and every single one of them looks just like you and me. Sorry. Gotta check to see what mom's doing. It's not expired or anything. Why would I buy expired dog food? I mean, honestly, all of it's probably expired. I don't know why I stopped to get dog food here rather than in when I was in town. Excuse me. I would like for my headlights to stay on. Excuse me. The car? Out of the way! Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not trying to flash you. I'm just having a really difficult time. Can I, can I get around them? Let me get around them. No! <laughs> They're just like, fuck that. I'm very sorry for flashing you. It was not my intention. Is there somebody behind me now? There's a light in my rear view mirror. Very weird to control because I'm using WAST. This is not even a road anymore. Um, what the hell? I mean, where's my GPS? 
If there is a GPS, like what? Excuse me. Stay on, please. Like, I'm dizzy. Is that a road back there? I don't know. I'm barely getting any service out here. This isn't even a road! I don't even think this is the right way. Is that the bridge? Bro. Come on. I just turn that off because I can't even can't even enjoy the damn radio anymore. <laughs> I'm not trying to flash you. See, I don't know the f Why would anybody use a purse for practical use? I don't use purses. I use backpacks. There's this weird thing about that. There was a weird thing about that night. I saw two big logs in the middle of the road blocking the way ahead. Sorry, hold on. I think I saw that the, that the fence starts right here. Let me just drive around because I'm not getting out to pull fucking logs out of the road. Not my job. Why is this car so hard to fucking turn? Off road driving! Oh. What the hell? I'll admit, I am a terrible driver. Uh, no, it's called the invisible wall says no. I'm a good driver, I swear. I didn't mean to scratch up the side of Dad's car. Alright, well, let me... Um... Pull off to the side, I guess? Ew. Oh gosh. Keep the car running. But I didn't think much of it at the time. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> That's definitely how that works. one more out of the way because I'm on this side of the road. If somebody's coming the other way, they can move the other log out of the way. Had to move the logs to go ahead. I did move the log. Is it just not moved all the way? I moved the log! What do you mean? It's moved. Oh. It's moved. God damn it doesn't need to be all the way out of the road. Um. Why does it look like there's somebody in my car? Car wouldn't start. Well, fuck. Let me just... And just like that, I was staring in the middle of nowhere with no phone service. Alright, man, let me move the log so in case other people come by, it stops them from just leaving me. Right, what happened to the other car ahead of me? Like... Also, I don't remember opening my head. I don't mean to make this sound like a cliche horror story, but... Throughout my life, I was told not to take rides from strangers. Mm. 
but at the moment I had no choice. I was scared to think how long it would take for someone to pass. Oh gosh. 10.23 p.m. Oh boy. Literally the car is still on. It is still moving. I saw a car. Oh my god. What happens if I just don't move? What happens if I don't move? What happens if I don't move? What? Oh my god. I don't know how somebody can leave another human being stranded like that. Well, I mean, I do. What happened to the other log? Oh no, it's still there. Bruh. 1043 p.m. I mean, we're not that far from the gas station. But to be honest, I would not be comfortable walking that distance back to the gas station at night or without anybody. Also, how did they, like, do that? <laughs> I can't even haul my horn anymore. <gasps> Wait. Sir! 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 Oh, God, I'm scared. Right, if, like, I don't, the only time that I'm gonna, okay. Oh, it's the dude from the gas station. Hi, I was trying to be nice to you earlier. Please don't kill me. Please don't kidnap and kill me. This, it's a 12 hour freaking drive. It's just like, I won't even do a 12 hour drive by myself. Like, six to eight hours Maybe, maybe. Anything above that? I can't do that by myself. I need a second driver with me. Right, don't ever leave the main roads past then. You're the girl from the gas station. I, think you would. I don't think anyone would stop for me here. What are you trying to do out here? I think my car just broke down. I can't come for help. There's no sub car. So, Shelva touches. You think I could get a ride? Where are you headed to? Just the nearest stop where I can call for help. Hop in. Hurry up. Just throw it all in the back. God, my car is so creepy. Can you back it up a little bit so you're a little closer, please? I should probably turn my headlights off in all honesty so it doesn't drain my battery so I need a new battery later. Uh, grab the dog food. I mean, but like, really, uh, there was, there was at one point where, I like how the dog food was the first thing I grabbed. Is that Mothman up there? Or is that a deer? Ah, um, oh, I could grab two things at a time, hell yeah. Uh, there was at one point where the highway that I was on started looking a little sketchy, like, it was clear that the highway hadn't been hadn't had like proper maintenance done in a while because it was like it was an older highway uh and it just it it, it was kind of unsettling to be honest but thankfully the, it didn't last too long why am I just, I'm just throwing my hat back there as if it's not gonna fly out Should I, I? I must already have my purse. I don't know. I just. Okay, whatever. Can you help me get my stuff? Oh my god. Hurry up. I need to get moving now. I'm done. I need to hop in. Be quick. I could have. Oh, hey. Oh, you, you reorganized shit for me. Thanks. I could have asked him for help. I doubt that he would have helped me, to be honest. Can I fuck around with any of your shit? Is 
so you won't tell me who you are, where, or, or where you're going. I'd rather say it's okay. I live really close from here. I was driving home. That piece of crap car broke down. Jason? What? My name is Jason. Oh! I mean, really, you shouldn't really tell people to, like, blah, 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 blah. But, be nice. My name is Jason. I'm Holly. Oh, I should have said it's nice to meet you, Jason. I mean, to be honest, I would give him a fake name. Like, Samantha. You're really lucky I had... I had to be on this side of town tonight. I must say you're one brave young woman. How's that? You got any clue what happened to your car back there? I think it was battery. It's an old car. That's it? I think so. I don't know. I'm fairly certain somebody cut my wires, actually. Uh, my car shouldn't have been smoking like that. So what do you think about... I told you back at the gas station. It's funny. Kind of creeped me out. Idiot tells that to every person that's traveling down here. You know what? That's probably why the other car didn't stop for me. Is because it's just like, don't stop for hitchhikers. But at the same time, it's like, really, you, unless they really, I, I don't know. Just, unless you have like proper stuff to protect yourself. Like it's, like nowadays it's extremely dangerous to stop for hitchhikers. Uh, I certainly don't <laughs> but that's just a personal preference because there's there's crazy people out there that pretend like they're being hitchhikers LMB so is it true about the monsters let's see I've never seen the monster for myself but there are there are some things and I'm afraid your car breaking down could have been one of them what Hey, listen, I don't want to sound like that moron, but just remember this. You don't... You don't bother them, and you don't be bothered. What? You don't bother them, and you don't be bothered. What do you mean? You know, I'm sorry for being a jerk to you before. I'm not the best with people. Understandable. I would say understandable. Yeah. Why do you have two things down there? Hmm. It pays off to be nice to people, by the way. Don't straight up be assholes. But don't also give them information about yourself. After a little bit of small talk, he dropped me by a motel. Apparently they offered roadside assistance. Besides, I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful, there are all kinds of people out there, he said anonymously before leaving. So wait, was this the only motel in the direction that he was going, or could he have taken me into town? Because we aren't in a town. <laughs> We're just in the middle of nowhere. Bye! Jeremy, I had to think for a moment. Vacancy. What is this called? So I know who to sue later. Free TV. Not approved for occupant. What? Before any person can use this building or any portion of this permit must be obtained from the must not be removed. Um, roadway and uh, what the fuck? Oh, I thought that was a cross on the in the back of this person's truck. Like what? Just a random cup out here. Oh, there's my stuff. Sweet. Can I check your mail for you? Or your garbage can? Why does it seem like it's darker now? Exactly. It looks like a fucking drop site for human trafficking. Right, the 
The man was putting out the creepiest vibes imaginable. I mean, that's just anybody. Hey, you're on the wall over there. Um. That is. Nature. Hi! Gal need a room to shack up for the night? I don't know why I gave him that voice. How much is it for a room? Uh, yes, I'm only going to be here for a few hours. $40 for a single. Pay cash only. What? Why? So I can't charge back for a horrible service? Room number nine, right over there. Talk about the car. $90. Tommy will take care of it next thing in the morning. Who's Tommy? Good, I'll let Tom know. And one last thing. Try not to wake the other guests. They might not take very nicely to it. Can I have a pencil? Can I come back there? No. A room key. Ah! Attack of the door. Room nine. Um. Grab my more. I can't grab my luggage, apparently. Um. What rooms are over here? One. I couldn't just go in any room. Well, he shouldn't have the door open. Isn't. Um. Wasn't the gas station missing an espresso machine? the hell kind of creepy area is this? Sorry, I, I know that like, it's just like, oh, you wouldn't ever do this in real life, but it's like is this just an unoccupied area or like a storage facility for it? Five, six, seven so nine's right over here? Oh, hey! You mean reroute? Dad, I may have to stay at a motel tonight. Hey, where are you? Your dad's calling me. Um, yeah, I'm here. That's eight. Um, nine? Oh, you got currents. What the fuck? What? Wait, wait a minute. We have curtains. But we don't. Except there was a smell. A type of musky smell you get from an old house. Um. Let's see. Where's our curtains? It is. It's a hundred percent a murder shed. I agree. I uh, don't know if I can show that or not. Somebody baggage here? Um. Whoa, wait, wait, what? Oh my god! Uh. Yes. I always go into the closet of my room anytime I get a room just to see how good of a hiding spot it is. It's okay. Oh boy. Oh my fucking god. Um. Um. Uh. <laughs> what are you doing here? I should be asking you. I'm Tommy. Room service here at Roadway Inn, the finest stopover in Norwood. What are you doing in here? You know, cleaning stuff. The guy at the front desk gave me this room. <laughs> don't fucking don't do that. 
I'm gonna have to ask you to step outside while I make the room. I'll just get my stuff. Dot dot dot. Dude, what the fuck? What are you doing in here with the door shut? Please wait outside while outside I said. Go get your stuff. Don't look at me like that, you fucking creep. You're the you're the one that's gonna fucking kill me. I guarantee that. Ah. It's got a lock, so like should be able to the only person that would be able to get in there is people with the keys to get in there. And that has one of those card keys things, so it's just like you can't just walk in there. I'm 100% sure that is the stolen espresso machine because they didn't have an espresso machine at the gas station. I only had two hands. Okay, but it, you know, you don't need them. You, you don't even need more hands just to carry that kind of stuff. Wait a minute. Can I use these? Hold on. I'm going to see if I can use those. Fucking hell, bitch. Yeah, that's my room. How did... How? When? Oh. Sorry, right. I'm gonna, gonna just gonna just, just, just you know fuck it. Just gonna throw it over here. Don't go through my stuff, please. Don't be a creep. Don't be a weirdo. More than what you already are. It looks like he's got his door open again. You didn't realize he was smiling? Yeah, dude, he's- he like- when I went to go talk to him again, he started smiling again. I forgot that I was gonna try to see if I could get one of these. They don't move. They're just... Yeah. Can you please leave? You are not funny. I don't like you. I'm just gonna start throwing my shit on my bed. I'm gonna close my door after me every time. I'm sure that's not gonna stop anybody from going in there, but still. So I wonder if, like, someone stole- whoever is in that room most likely stole that fucking espresso machine. It had to be. There's just, like, no way that they didn't. I don't see the one van, though. This, however, looks like the car that passed us. Uh, on the road and then somehow disappeared in front of us and then was behind us again. This is the same car. And that has to be the espresso machine from the freaking gas station. 100%. I'm willing to bet on it. I need you to please stop. Stop doing that. Please get out. Had a word with Joe about the situation. What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, mercy. But don't you worry, it's safe here. I go get your car. It's I'll go get your car. And also the room's phone is not working. If needed anything, just ask at the front desk. We've been trying to get it fixed, but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately. <laughs> but you have a good night. Oh, don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me! I want to see where he goes. Sorry, I just I just really want to see where he goes. I'm just gonna go to the front desk to make a call. Uh, since I haven't replied to fucking anybody apparently, but I I get enough service to get messages. Why do you walk so slow? Are you going to go get my car right now? Oh my god. Fucking run me over, why don't you? 
I need to use your phone. You have a great night's sleep. I need your phone. You don't fucking... You have a phone right there. I just... Right there. I need to use it. I need to use it, please. Please! Why do I run so fast now? Frickin' the flash. I mean... I don't think I'm allowed to show that, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna sleep with my things. Call it foresight, but there's something very off about that place. Face to get up. Get up. Hey. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I felt tiredness was overwhelming by my anxiety. My anxiety. Hey, achoo! Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. Okay, so yeah. That dude is a total creep. Um. Why did it sound like somebody was using my bathroom now? Ch Don't chase creeps. Anywhere. So what, it, what does it say that we needed a coffee? Anything else? No? <gasps> I didn't need it. What? Why are there somebody's drugs in there? Why are somebody's drugs in there? I don't trust that coffee though. That is a stolen coffee machine, a hundred percent. That is a hundred percent a stolen coffee machine. Because there was a sign at the gas station talking about their frappuccino machine and they didn't have one. A cola? Nachos? Like chips or those are Doritos. Nuts, chocolate, chocolatey nuts. Um, energy soda. Fuck that coffee. We don't need coffee. We'll put soda. Um, let's just why why get up? Why who would I would not be getting up? I was low on cash for that. Yeah. So, okay, I can't. I can only run across the fucking parking lot. Okay, that's nice to know. Doritos. I want the Dorito. I'm gonna just go into any room. There's a paint bucket here. This is everything. Um. There's no money. That's sketchy as fuck. I haven't ever applied to anybody. Andy? Andy? Mom, Dad? Peter Church is just like my trip to Arkansas when I lost service when we went hiking. I never got it back. Um. <laughs> right. There is, um. Why does he have a paint can here? Why is it like. There was literally. Nothing available except for espresso and cappuccino. And I'm fairly certain it's because it is spiked. 
Can I collect it and go to my room? I mean, who just starts drinking as soon as they get it from the thing? Bro, it's all orange. Oh boy. What? I accidentally clicked control and I think I messed the game. Oh no, the game sign. Oh, why is everything backwards? Why is everything inverted? Um... Let me go... Uh, to the office? I can't run. Where is he at? Where everything is inverted, I can't fucking see. Oh my god! You, if if you get seizures from this kind of stuff, please do not look at the screen. I can't. I can't read right now. Dad, mom, I think I'm fucking drunk. Shut I'm stuck behind the door. What the fuck? I can't. Dude, this is even no idea how hard this is. Oh my god. That I couldn't not consume the drugged coffee. It wouldn't not let me. I was drugged at the gas station. Oh boy. 3.18 a.m. Why am I- if I, w I was sedated, um, you were roofied is the correct term. That should not have worked. They just- Right. It fucking does that. Bro, my fucking vision is all out of whack too. Damn. You fucked me up. Oh my god, what? Oh my god. Um, why is there a naked man in my closet? What? Oh my god. No, please tell me that. Oh god. <laughs> okay. So don't open the closet door. I had a little bit of talk. He dropped me. Ah, oh, we're all the way back there again. Dude. <laughs> yeah, that, that got me too. Um, oh, we're all the way up here again. No. Hi. Gonna be here for a few nights. Hey. Uh. Talk about the car. Pay. Hey. I know. That would be. It'd be one thing if it was like the whole thing. But like. Thank gosh that there was like a save system. But that is a hundred percent the stolen frappuccino machine. Close your motherfucking door. Bitch. I'm fairly certain walking there and not walking there doesn't make a difference because he's already following me. I thought that said hell, where are you? Smell. Uh, kind of get from an old house. <laughs> Bitch. You scared the crap out of me. 
are you? What are you doing in here? Front desk. Blah, 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 blah. Leave. Suck off. I don't know why they walk so slow. It's like, what the fuck? Like, I, I sprint. I can run faster than this in real life. I would already be at that office by now. But like... Oh my god. <laughs> Grab the most essential things. My hat and skateboard. I think dinner should be about done right now. Okay, after this, I might... Call it a night. Thank you for making my bed. I'm just gonna throw my shit on there. Watch my room for me. Don't let any creepy naked men crawl into my closet, please. She'll be like, hey, I had a vision that there was a creepy naked man that roofied me and 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 hid in my closet. Could you do something about it? So places like this, I uh, I'll, I'll just say right now, I would not stay at a fucking motel ever. <laughs> I would rather pay I mean right now it's already overpriced for what they're paying right now per night is what I could get at a slightly better hotel or an enclosed motel that isn't like this and creepy. Where's the dog food? Did I already grab the dog food? Yeah, I guess I did. I wonder if I start walking down the road, does he come and attack me too? I only had two hands. Blah 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 yeah, please. I'll open the door for you. Now close close the door behind you. Go to bed. I mean, that didn't... I don't see shit. Can you not? So, like... Well, first sight, there was something very off about that place. Um... Uh, so now we gotta go die from being roofied. I don't think that was Jeremy. It didn't look like Jeremy because that is his car, I'm pretty sure. That is the car that was ahead of us. But I'm fairly certain that it's like multiple people behind him, maybe? And Jeremy did tell, like, warn us, be like, be careful. I don't know. Mm. Yeah, I wonder. I couldn't just go. I couldn't just go into any room. I wasn't trying to get into any room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Come on. Uh. Uh. My fucking sprint key is all stuck too. <laughs> Sprinting doesn't work. But no, open the door. Take the drugs. Trying to get in bed. Ruthie asked. So don't open the closet. Was he just gonna come and kill us or something?
Oh my god. So that, like... I literally just watched him. Why can't I... I was about to say Do, do, do. I'm just going to the bathroom. Hmm. God, how many times am I going to wash my hands and then... Dude, I legit just heard him scuffling around in there. feel safe going out. Neither do I. I don't feel safe being in here. I just go to bed? What am I doing? I literally saw you lagging out of there. Um, I, am I supposed to be doing something? Wash my hand. Am I, am I bathing in the sink right now? I just keep turning the water. I'm not opening the door. I already know not to open the fucking door. Who is it? Joe from the front desk. Open the door. Fuck you. Yeah, there's somebody in my closet. Didn't I specifically tell you not to wake anyone up? I have complaints. What are you making all those goofy noises for? Whatever it is, just keep it down, miss. Is that... Why are your eyes all red? Coffee machine. Your stolen coffee machine. Are you messing with me? We don't have no coffee machine here. Right over there. Okay, okay. Here. I've had enough crazy enough of you crazy goons here for once. I thought we had a sober guest, but I guess I'm the crazy one here. I could have just said that I'm fucking tired. I hate my job. What happens if I bring him in here? I mean, I don't want to do it all. I'm fairly certain it's not going to I don't think that's what I'm supposed to do, but Oh god, that's scary. Come with me, Joe. Wait, that was your name, right? I'm in. Where is it now? I mean, is that why I have this weird red glare? Why are... Everything is dark. Why are all the lights off? That is, is not how you run a fucking motel. It's not how you run a motel. Why is your... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It's the van! Oh my god, it's the van from before. How did he get out of the van if the it's right against... Oh my god. This idiot doesn't know how to park. Or turn off his headlamps. Your battery's gonna go dead. You have a, a stalker kidnapper van right outside your motel vicinity. Dude. Can you be any slower? It was right here. Check inside their room. Go back to the room. I swear to God it was here. What is it? happen. I said go back now. Fuck you. Do you know I'm here? I said go back to the room and don't get out. There should be some medication. Fuck your medication. Check the table with the TV. Dude. Okay, normal people don't put medication in rooms for people. Like, what if I'm allergic to that? Hmm? You don't know. I can't really run it either. Not cool. Uh, 
This is not cool. Requires water. He left. Well, oh, I. He just doesn't lock the room, though. Like, he can't get in unless it's a lock. Unless he's got a key. I gotta watch some... A little bit of that first. I'm scared. I'm gonna sleep with the dog food tonight. Can I not sleep with the dog food? Yeah, hydrate. I can't sleep with the fucking dog food. Okay, well, whatever. Dog food sleeps with the luggage. Sit here and watch. Bro, I'm, I'm on some serious fucking drugs right now. Close your eyes and go to sleep. Off. Go away. Go away. I'm not here. You didn't see me walk into my room earlier. After you fucking roofied me and after I took medication. Hello? Go away. He's like standing off to the side. I'll stand in the corner where he won't see me and I'll attack him. The bar won't stay quiet because it can hear my computer running. Oh god. Why is the light off? Why is the light off? Oh, that's just... <laughs> Go away! Who is it? Achoo! Achoo! Excuse me, sorry. over the microphone so that way it doesn't make the noise because if I if I don't cut my hands around the microphone it picks up the the la the the fan noise from the laptop mm -hmm. dude go away That's what I'm supposed to do. I'm looking for 
Yes. Yes, yes. Oh. oh my god. Joe? This is was that your name? Thank you. I've been saved. To this day I find it really weird that the manager interfered not to or manager inferred not to get police involved as it would affect Motel's reputation and let go of the situation. I believe that the town could have been home to a cult or a drug ring or possibly something worse. It wasn't even a town. Tommy arrived with the car after what felt like a year longest night of my life it was a fucking year uh, I never went on long road trips again I would always take airplanes I mean I would still probably go on a road trip but not alone and not at night who wanted to check the well I think he checked the the um bathroom first because he heard the water running Maybe? It's just like, no, screw that. I need the name and the place of this town. This town's motel. And then tell my parents and how my parents just deal with that. It's like, yeah, um, soon. That was that. That was that second one really got me.